Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, your ClickFunnels account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you add or create a product in your ClickFunnels account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, a real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video. But why would you want to add a product into your ClickFunnels anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're creating landing pages in ClickFunnels, you can add a product so that way your funnels have a purchase goal. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your ClickFunnels account. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my ClickFunnels account and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to add a product here on the left screen, you want to click on products. Looks like a little box with a heart on it. Once you do that, you're going to see a drop down menu and you want to click on all products. All right. Once you do that, you're going to see all the products that you have listed inside of your ClickFunnels. And to add a new product, click on create product here on the top right. Okay. So here you get to choose, are you going to be selling a digital product or a physical product? For the purpose of this video, I'm going to go ahead and choose digital product. Next, you're going to go ahead and name the product that you're putting in your ClickFunnels. So for me, I'll just do YouTube make money. Okay. They do let you know your customer will be able to see this product name. This is going to be the public facing product name. And here you can go ahead and type in a description. So that way your customers know what they're purchasing. There's a course on making money online with YouTube. Okay. So I typed in a quick description and I'm going to click on create product. Okay. So here you have to choose what type of pricing option. So is it going to be a one-time payment? Is it some sort of a subscription or are you allowing some sort of a payment plan for this product in your ClickFunnels? For the purpose of this video, I'm going to choose one-time payment and then I'm going to go ahead and just put this at 500. Okay. Now that we've chosen a price, I'm going to click on set price. Okay. So here we're going to go ahead and continue editing and adding this product. So first we're going to go ahead and select an image. If you need help with an image, usually I use Fiverr. So I'll just let them know what I'm looking for and then kind of a few examples and I'll get that created in Fiverr. If you need help with that, check my video description. I'll try to leave a referral link there, but I'm going to go ahead and add an image here. Okay. So I added an image and we're scrolling down a little bit more. So if you're selling a product that is physical, you might need to add tax. You can go ahead and click right here and then you can go ahead and classify the tax ID. I'm not going to do that because this is a digital product here. You can go ahead and manage the shipping and inventory. So you can add a SKU. And if you need fulfillment, you can go ahead and click here and then track your inventory. If you need to do that, if it's a physical product, you can go ahead and notate the weight and where the product is going to be manufactured. Okay. So once you fill out this form, you can go ahead and scroll back up to the top and then you can go ahead and tag the product. So for example, if this is some sort of a Chinese food product, we would just tag it as Chinese food. If it's Mexican food, you would tag it as Mexican food. And that way you can kind of organize your products later and search through your products. And then once you're ready, go ahead and scroll to the bottom and click on update product. Okay. So now this product is available. So we're going to click on products here on the top center. Okay. Now you can see that that product that we created inside of ClickFunnels is now listed in the product list. So as we're putting together funnels, we can go ahead and add this product into that funnel. So there you have it guys. If you're wondering how to add or create a product to sell inside of your ClickFunnels, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.